Welcome back, guys. It's me, Andrew Draponich, and this is Walkthrough Part 26. And before we start this episode, I need to show you guys, or just let you guys know what is up. And you are going to vote right now. Well, at least for this episode, I did say what I was going to do last episode. I did get a Tyranitar in replace of Scrafty. And I did use Superior, which was that little Snivy that we had in replace of Torterra. But I want you guys to go in the comments right now and just vote if you want Tyranitar or Scrafty on the team. Right now, we're going to put on Tyranitar just because I want Tyranitar on right now to make something new and fresh for the episode. And I'm going to put it on Superior for this episode. And those are the two replacements. But if you guys really want to keep uh, Scrafty, because Scrafty is really fucking good. Um, great, um, you know, average Pokemon. He's just kind of weak on the, on the, on the, bleh, can't even talk right now. He's just kind of weak. On the other hand, and Torterra is just a monster, which is just, I, I mean, Torterra's fucking cool. But since I had ground type, I replaced it with a rock on Tyranitar, and then the fighting is part of... Um, well, we have no fighting anymore, but we have we still have grass and we have dark still from the Tarnatar. And that is what we are going to do. Giratina is just going to go on the end of my party. He's just kind of like the savior of the whole team. He's like a dog. <laughs> He's going to go on the end, and then Dragonite is going to go there, and then switching everything around real quick. Damn it, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, Tarnatar and switch it with Charizard. Okay, we're good. Let's get out of the Pokemon Center. Damn, we're already a minute in the video. That's how this video flies. Everything goes so fast. Alright, so we got Tyranitar, which is level 72. Um, he got Rock Slide, Crunch, Thrash, and Earthquake, which is a great moveset. Do not get me wrong. That is a fucking awesome moveset. And Superior has Sludge Bomb and Leaf Blade, which is an awesome, awesome combo. And Leaf Seed, and then Giga Drain is a dog move, which is really strong. So, Charizard is good, which I would like to replace with Typhlosion, but, um, I think somebody actually told me to fly back and see a Professor Oak, but I don't know where Professor Oak is, um, in one of these towns. I, I, I'll do it, I'll do it in between episodes. Do not worry, whoever t uh, said that to me, I will go back and try and get to, uh, Cyndaquil, because I want to see if Cyndaquil is better than Typhlosion. But we need Charizard for fly, fuck. On second thought, <laughs> I do need Charizard for fly. Alright, so we're gonna battle this little dude. Camper Paulo is a Marowak. Oh, and that's awesome. I forgot about the um the sandstorm. Always have a sandstorm up. That is so good. I love that. There is a girl right there. It looks like I gotta find her through the little maze. Do I have my super repels on or am I just getting lucky through all this grass? Hypno's gonna get raped by a crunch. Boom! Dude, that was awesome. Um, let's actually go ahead and use a super repel. Let's give the miracle seed to Superior. Alright. Went around. Luxury ball. Talk to her. Pearl. Oh, Drew, I was looking for stronger Pokemon to battle with, but I'll fight you with what I have. Cool. So we're going to take on Pokemon Trainer Pearl. He's got an Arcanine level 63. Which is going to get owned by a Rock Slide with Stab from Tyranitar. And Sceptile, we're going to go into Charizard and light this shit up. Actually, I'm just going to go for Fly. <laughs> It'll be better. Fly is stronger. No, I, I don't know. It's just I wanted to go for Fly and make it different instead of always burning shit up with Flamethrower. Alright. She talks about the Gym Leaders of Lorne, and we're just going to keep going to the right. Except it is a dead end. So, let's just get on Charizard, fly back to the, uh, remember where that guy was, like, blocking the way? Well, I think, unless they have a gym in this town, I'm not sure. Um, okay, let's go back out. Is there a gym in this town? I have no idea. Oh, yeah. No, wait, is this the gym? No, this is a daycare. Ah! <laughs> oh, here she is. Here's Pearl. Oh, wait, wait, I, I'm lost. Wait, am I really gonna get another Pokemon? Okay, cool. So I guess Pearl came back, and Pearl is um. All right. So I guess we just got a Tepig as well. Okay. We got a Tepig. That's cool. What do you mean, stay away? 
hold on a second. I think there's something glitched about what I'm doing right now. If I think what I'm about to find out is true... Oh my god! He's got a glitch in the game. Where if you battle her, you can go back and get the other starter. That's so cool, but after you do it twice to get all three starters, it's kind of gay. Hold on, I'm actually going to skip the, um... Alright, Arcanine's dead and Sceptile. Uh, yeah. So, it looks like there is a little glitch in the game. Unless I forgot to do something, but I don't know what I forgot. So, she, like, goes away. And then she's going to skip. I'm going to skip the little, the little thing right here of going in there. And I'm just going to keep going. And, yep, that's how you do it. That is how you do it. It's just, I guess nobody ever actually tried to go back in there. And I was the first one to do it because I don't ever remember anybody doing that and going back and getting all three starters from that. But if y'all think I should get the third starter, let me know because all I'd have to do is go back in there. All I'd have to do is go back in the building and do that. So, um, I'm actually going to use Tepig instead of um, Charizard, but I'm going to actually go ahead and do that next episode unless y'all want me to do it right now. Um, oh my god, he's got Arm Thrust. Um, I tell y'all what, since this is the like all this black and white two stuff going on I'm actually gonna go back and get the um third water type and use all three of them on the journey oh wait hold on ah you can only do it one time look yup look at that that's weird holy shit did y'all just notice that you can only do it one time you can get two Pokemon that's cool though alright well Oh, my Pokemon need to be healed up. Alright. Tyranitar needs to be healed up. He's about to die. And let's just run. Bitches be in my way, dog. Let's go get on with this game. 502, let's go. Tyranitar. Muck. Um, Earthquake's gonna just put Muck into the ground, so. Yeah. I always noticed that. That's why I always knew Earthquake is effective on, like, Muck back in the day in Red and Blue version. If you fucking Earthquake Muck, it's going to go in the ground and not come out. It's going to get stuck. Alright, so this dude talks about protein. Jonas has a Polyrath. I'm going to go for Thrash. And wow, that submission killed his own Pokemon. I don't know why he's got the trainer so like low. In I guess it's just for extra training or some shit. Because, um, the, uh, the, uh, fuck, what was it again? The, um... The rivals Pokemon were actually frustration. The rivals Pokemon were actually really strong, like in the '60s and stuff, and that's what I thought Airbys was gonna be like. So, yeah. Oh, but I'm pretty sure that the gym leaders now, the gym leaders Pokemon in this region are gonna be very, very, very high, like at like 70 plus. They they're gonna be like that. I'm guessing, but they're, um, I don't know. This is. This is Silver. There's so many, like, rivals that he put in here, like, trainers and shit that he put in this game. It's great. Oh, Typhlosion! I still like Embor better. Embor is way better. Just saying. Because he's fighting type, too. <gasps> and we can use Embor for the replacement fighting type for Scrafty. Yes! And then Charizard's just gonna... I I I'm gonna get rid of Charizard after this shit. Oh, he's got my game. Well, I'm not gonna, like... I don't know if I'm going to get rid of Charizard yet. I probably will just switch him out for um, Embor and then use Embor and then give like some other Pokemon to fly, like Giratina or some shit. I probably won't even use Fly because in this game, you don't really have to go back and forth. You just kind of continue straight forward where you're at. And if I really have to fly, then I'll just get Charizard out of the PC or some shit like that. That is what I'm going to do. Uh, that is the final answer. Is that the final answer? Ah, oh, Superior's time to shine. Leaf Blade. Oh my god, I love Leaf Blade in Gen 3. It's fucking legit. I like that. A little cutting leaves and shit. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna pick up an Ultra Ball. I don't know why I have all these Ultra Balls. I don't even need them. I don't need them! Um, run away. Cats and shit. Alright. Oh, we have to fight a Bug Catcher. Christian has an Ariados. And I have nothing to take that down with. Charizard, let's do good. Let's go. Um, flamethrower. Flamethrower to the face. And let's go ahead and get that super potion. And we are in Rocavelli City. Rocavelli City. Rocavelli. I don't know how to say that. 
There's the Pokemon Center. We're gonna go ahead and go in the Pokemon Center. And, um... Alright, let's do this. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and take out Charizard right now. Oh, and I, I do not think that I was gonna switch out Swampert from... Oh, I, I totally forgot about what I'm thinking. Am I stupid? No. I just miscalculated because, look, I'm thinking that I'm not gonna have a Ground-type Pokemon with Torterra being gone. I totally forgot the fact that I had a Swampert on my team. Wow, that's just... That's just totally like... Like, not even like knowing. <laughs> What a fail on my part. That's just great. Alright, so... I know those guys were in a lot of our videos and stuff, but... The time to shine is gonna dry out. Probably not Charizard, because I'll just come back in here to get him for, um... Um... For, um, another episode later on. But I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, give that lucky shit, whatever it's called, to, um... Our new Embor! Why am I saying Embor? It's a Tepig, dude. Dude. But I, I like the superior combo and all that stuff. It looks really cool. Um, is there a way to get charcoal to power up fire tunnels? I don't even know. He'll probably get some badass move, like Ice Smash and all that stuff, like the other one got. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and check out every little person in this town. Um, you know, all the little doors and shit. This dude has an Aeron, which is kind of cool. Aerons are pretty legit when you evolve them into Aeron. I remember I had one on Pokemon. Um,. I had one on Pokemon Sapphire, and it was so good. Metal power boosts up the steel. Is that what he gave me? Metal powder? Oh, cool. We'll give that to Tepig. Raises defense. Shit, I could use some damn defense. Alright. Wait, does Tyranitar have anything? I'm actually going to do that to Tyr Tyranitar. Because he would seem like he needs more defense. When it comes to, like getting hit and shit. Yeah, Tyranitar would be the one to hold some metal defense. I mean, metal power. I mean, metal powder. Alright, so this dude's blocking the gym. Looks like we're gonna have to go into the mines. Something like that. That door's locked. I'm gonna roll up here. <laughs> he gave his Steelix a quick one. That's weird. Um, we're gonna go in there after. Um, looks like we're still in the city. All right, we got a fossil. Um, is there like anything else on here? What is this? All right. So that is the gym leader who we had just taught, spoken to. All right. It looks like this little thing is. Why is that one gold? And why are we getting all these fossils? I'm so confused. Why do we have all these fossils? The root fossil. Predator fossil. Spiral fossil? I, I have no idea what those fossils are going to be used for at all. Jim, I'm pretty sure I have to go in the mining thing, but I'm going to wait real quick. There's a little Mount Lauren, which is cool. Go ahead and head in there later. One more thing, too. We get TM49, which is Rock Slide. Oh, that is some cool shit. We just got rock slide from a random dude. And the mart and everything is just chilling. Oh, we forgot to check out the Pokemon Center, people. Alright, so that is that. This dude is... Okay. And that is it. That is it. Let's actually... I'm pretty sure we have to go in the museum thing. I'm going to actually go in there first. But if not, I think you go into Mount Lauren. Alright, let me see. Oh, look, it makes the fossils go into the Pokemon. That's what I was looking for. The damn thing where it, where they transform and stuff. Alright, let's see which, which guy does it. Which one of you are the fossil extravagant people? Alright, not you. Alright. Hi, Drew, I'm doing some work here and they're finding what you mean to hurry so you can challenge it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright, so I guess that's it. The gym leader is going back to the gym. I can't run around in here, damn it. I can run around on the first floor. So the gym is open. Guys, we're going to take on that gym next episode. Peace! Comment, like, and subscribe to me, Andrew Drew Ponage. We'll be back with some more Pokemon Life Platinum next time.
Probably shouldn't be that long. I'm going to try and upload more frequently. I know I keep telling you guys this, but look, I have been seeing lots of black and white too. I'm actually going to do a black and white too walkthrough, but it's not going to be until the English patched version comes out or until the actual English version comes out because I cannot play a game. What's my boy Hunter is actually trying to play his game uh, right now. Do the walk. It's just it's a pain in the ass. I can't even like read all that Japanese stuff. So I'll let you guys know what's going to go on next time, and see you guys later. Bye. Yeah.